Hybrid orbitals are formed by a mixing of the hydrogen-like s, p, and d orbitals that characterize a free atom. The three p orbitals are directed along the x, y, and z axes. When we mix an s and a px orbital, we produce two hybrid orbitals called sp pointed in opposite directions along the x-axis. Mixing of an s with the px and py orbitals produces three equivalent hybrid orbitals in the xy plane. We call these sp2 hybrid orbitals. Notice that the hybrid orbitals have major lobes which contain most of the electron density in the orbital. These are used in bonding to other atoms. Mixing of the S with all three P orbitals results in formation of four equivalent SP3 hybrid orbitals directed toward the apices of a tetrahedron. Let's apply the concept of hybridization to ammonia. Here is the Lewis structure for ammonia. There are four electron pairs in the nitrogen valence orbitals. We know that an ammonia molecule has a pyramidal shape. This shape can be explained by assuming that the central nitrogen atom employs sp3 hybrid orbitals. The unshared electron pair occupies the fourth sp3 hybrid orbital.